Hey guys, Micah McGee here. We are going to pick some corn today. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button and turn that thing gray. We want to keep it gray. We're going to pick corn today. This is going to be a hickory cane field, uh, special corn that we grow for bread. Look here, folks. I want to show you something. This corn made three big ears. I'll just chuck them down so you can see. Off this one stalk, we got it made three big ears. One, two, three. We'll be able to dry that good, grind it up, and make bread out of it. Okay, here's the soybeans that we planted in amongst the corn. You can see they're loaded with beans all the way up. And you can also see that the deer have been nipping off these uh, top leaves. So that's a good sign. We know we got deer here. So what is hickory cane corn, you might ask? It is an old, old strain of corn that it's open pollinated. We save our own seed every year. And I want you to look at the size of these kernels. I mean, almost as wide as my finger, huge kernels. And what that does, when you grind that for your cornbread, that means there's a lot less um, siftings that you have to sift out of it, of that old kernel uh, shell, or whatever makes the, whatever it is that you have to sift out of cornmeal when you grind it. It is a super corn for cornbread. That is what hickory cane corn is. Let's go, boys. Let's get her done. Any of these ears that are really buggy and um, not looking real good, we're just going to take that straight to the pig. She'll love it. Here's what we're picking. We're getting us some good old hickory cane corn here. Here's the, what we call the coals that we don't really want to eat. We save them for the pig and we'll shell them out for her. She don't really look like she's able to really eat it off the cob real good. So we'll shell them out for her and feed her some of that every day till it's gone, so. We're off excited. We got that corn picked. Now we can get over there and we can bush hog that field and we can uh, disc it up and get it planted with clover for the deer. So we're excited about that. We're going to wrap up this video. You have a great day. We're going to see you on the next video.